Hello and welcome to another indie horror game. This time I'll be playing a game called Escape and if you want to try it out for yourselves you can for free if you just follow the link down below in the description. All the links or the details will be down there. Now in this game I'm going to be playing as someone trying to escape from an abandoned hospital and also a monster lurking in the darkness. Apparently there's things to collect, puzzles to complete and the whole game is supposed to have Lovecraftian influences and I can see a few on the menu here. Hope you enjoy it. Leave your thoughts down below in the comments. Like or dislike the video at the end, alright? Here we go. Let's play. So the morgue. Okay, we've only got access to one chapter, it seems. Uh, I woke up in an old abandoned hospital with morgue. I do not know why I am here. I need to find a way out. I don't want to stay here for one more sec. And, I suppose. So, normal or hard. Wide vision, short vision... Well, let's, let's, let's stick with normal. Okay. I woke up in this place. It seems to be a hospital or a morgue. I do not know how I come here, or came here. I must escape from this place. Okay, the man has a plan. Kind of. And he's also got a cursor. That he can toggle on and off. Alright, X marks the spot. Okay. <laughs> there you go, there's a Lovecraftian influence right there. Well, thanks for that. <laughs> thanks for that, vote of confidence, big guy. Oh, well, that was just his little way of welcoming me to the game, I suppose. Right, so, let's have a little look around, shall we? What can I do? I can I can sprint with shift. It seems like it's on a toggle system, that's a bit weird. Inventory, okay. Uh, looks like I didn't bring anything with me. Always good to come prepared. Looks like I need to find ten something or other. Ten medallions, coins, ten of these, maybe? I need to find some Q. I've got zero Q right now. And no Triforce pieces either. Maybe I need to find those too. Hmm, okay. I don't think I can jump. I don't think I can crouch either. Oh, I can! I can with C. Okay. Right, let's go. I think I'm all warmed up. <laughs> let's see if we can find a way to escape this place. Oh, this might be the first of the ten. Yeah, I think it is. And based on that rather ominous music, I wish I never picked that up. Can I put that back down again? <laughs> Do I actually have to find nine more? Or is it just like a collectible thing? Not really sure. What's this? This stands out. A scalpel? I got a knife! I got a knife! Okay, that is the first of our many items. Um, so we just drag and drop. Yep, okay. I think I'm actually trying to slice and dice the wall. To no avail. <laughs> it's made of sturdier stuff. Alright, cupboards. Yep, drawers. Wait. Do that again. <laughs> That's a door, not a drawer. <laughs> I think you got the sound effects mixed up. This one sounded alright. That one sounds like a drawer. Either way, it looks like there's nothing to find here. Okay, it looks like there's a lot to find in the morgue lockers. What about this one? Nothing in there. Apart from me. Ah, maybe this is my safe space. Maybe this is my sanctuary away from the monster that lurks in the darkness. Or maybe not. Either way, let's have a little look. Can't open or close these doors, apparently. We got bones, we got skulls. Got a dead body over there. Whoa! Okay, he wanted to make himself known. Look at that. You need a I've got a knife! I've got a knife. Do I actually need a knife? Do I need to do this? It works. Why did I do that? There's literally no reason I had to do that. <laughs> I wasn't even sure if I was in a morgue or an abandoned hospital a minute ago, but for some reason I know I need to cut this guy open. I'm so sorry. There's nothing in there either. Literally nothing. Yeah, I'm so sorry, really. I'm sorry for desecrating your corpse. Alright, nothing there. Okay, anything on the table? Okay. Um, well, I think we found everything we're supposed to find, so let's leave and let's see if we can find a way to escape this place. That's not a good start. Can't open the door. Uh, do I need to slice and dice it open? No. Huh. Uh, am I absolutely certain there wasn't anything in that guy's chest cavity? Sorry about this. <laughs> For the second time, I'm dragging you out. There's nothing, right? 
I wish I could jump to get the proper angle. I don't need to, like, cut you open more, do I? No. Hmm. Nothing in your hand? No. They're open. Nothing dropped to the floor. Alright, sorry again. In you go. Night, night. Uh, well, I must have missed something somewhere. Nothing in the drawers. No. <laughs> I love that sound effect. Nothing down there. We're looking for, like, hidden switches, buttons, levers, keys. Maybe something dangling from the ceiling. I don't know. Maybe something behind the statue. Yeah. You hiding something, big guy? No. No, apparently not. Hmm. Maybe there's some clues that I'm just missing here. I'm stumped in the first room, and I don't have any cue yet. This is not good. <laughs> well, there's got to be something somewhere. I can't open these, right? They're jammed. They're broken. I can't really see what's inside. I oh. Oh. That was a button? That brick was a button. I think it may, I think it may have just unlocked the door. Okay. That, uh, that freaked me out. The doors open by themselves. I was waiting to click, to be honest. Like I had to to determine if it was locked or not, but no, alright. Well, there you go. There's the first spook of the game. Right. Left or right? Left sounds spooky, so let's go left. Yeah, I'm not alone here. What the hell was that? Looks like we got another body. Is this the Q thing? That's an eye from Ancient, apparently. Have I still got... Okay, I've still got the uh, the scalpel, the knife thing. Here we go. Hey, right. Okay, well, at least there was a point to actually opening this guy up. Someone's opening and closing doors. That's a little bit alarming, honestly. Yeah, I am not alone. I am not alone. Okay, <laughs> maybe I shouldn't have gone that way. Maybe I should have gone the other way. Is that? That's another one! That's number three! Any more? No? What am I hearing? Okay. i just got to get used to these doors opening by themselves. Can't pick that up. We've got a pot, we got a pan, but no, nope, not working. Oh, oh shit, okay, we <laughs> we got the monster, we got the monster, where's this? Oh, that, oh, that, that was the other way, wasn't it? Okay, right. Uh, maybe I should have ran back to the locker, actually. Right, what is Q? Okay. Oh, was that? Oh, God, that's me! <laughs> so I'm looking through the monster's eyes when I do that? Okay, fucking hell. Right. <laughs> just hide, just hide. Oh god. That freaked, that freaked me out! It really did. Okay, so we got some stairs there. Right. Anything in the fridge? Oh yes, we got another one of these. Another little statuette. Another- ah! Oh jeez, okay. Okay, alright. It seems like I can fairly easily outrun him, but fucking hell. What we got here? I need a security room key. In here? No, that's fine, that's fine. Another corpse. This time a headless corpse. Ah! Okay! Jeez, okay. Well, I don't actually know if there was anything there or not. Right. In here again. Okay, right. Calm down. Oh, I, I just ran out of stamina, actually. I'm on red now, which means I can't sprint at all. Oh, boy. So I can outrun him, but not for long. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right. Yeah. So far, so good. It seems like a fairly simple game. It feels like a, a mobile game, or it could be a mobile game, honestly. It feels kind of like Granny, a little bit. Or a game a little bit like that. I kind of want to stay on this level to start with. I, uh, I want to be pretty thorough trying to find these coins. There we go. Right. Let's go around him. I can go around him. I can do that. 
Oh, there we go. I was, try <laughs> I was trying to run through the wall. Right. So, was there something in that guy's chest cavity? No. Fuck. Something in here. No. Nothing on the x-ray. Nothing on the bed. <laughs> it always seems to be the top left one that has the wrong sound effect, but... Okay. What we got here? An electricity room and a body, of course. An eye room. I need a key. I need a key. Okay. No power. Right. Okay. Well, we're right next to the power room, I think. So let's go cut this guy's chest open. You never know. Could come in handy. Actually, yeah. There's another one. If I can grab it. There we go. So that's number four. Maybe if I find ten, I could use it as a weapon against the monster or something. Oh, look, there's another one. Am I sure that this is the power room? <laughs> it looks like another morgue to me. Hang on. Okay. Uh, okay, right. Does that, like, shake when he's nearby or something? Is that, like, a good sign that he's, he's on his way? Maybe. Maybe things just sort of rattle around. Right, so I need to sort out the power. I need to have a look inside those guys' chest cavities. What we got here? Okay, that is that is a locked door. Maybe I should go upstairs. Let's go upstairs. But let's not use all of our stamina. Oh, shit. Let's just see what we got here. Okay, there you go. There's number five. Five down, five to go. I think he's underneath me right now. Okay, I'm going in here. There's another one. Right, I can keep an eye on him, I suppose. Let's see where he's going. <laughs> <laughs> okay, alright. Oh no, that's not going to work. That is definitely not going to work. Okay. That one can't open the door. Okay, short right. Again, almost, almost ran out of stamina there. He's not so much of a threat when you've got some stamina. But yeah, he can sort of quite easily catch up to you. Did I just see a chain across that door? Right, okay. Let's go back through here. I'm going to see if I can lose him in a room that I, you know, I've already kind of explored this, right? Nothing else, no. Okay, he's nearby. I do quite like the concept of the statuettes, seeing through his eyes, even though he looks like he doesn't really have any eyes, or he's got like, blackened eyes. Let's go up here. I don't know which floor he's on, honestly, but I'm pretty sure I did see... Yeah, there's there's a chain over this one. Can't open this door. Nice to see that there's a, a locker here. We got something here? Anything in here? No. Hmm. Need to find more coins. Need to find a security room key. I need to find another statue. Oh, actually, that's a coin, isn't it? Yeah, there you go. It's not bad. Can't open that door. Right. Is he going to chase me down? Mm, yes, he is. <laughs> Maybe I should have put this guy on hard mode. I don't know. He's not too much of a threat. Although he was sort of sneaking up on me a few times, so maybe I shouldn't speak so soon. Okay, let's go up here. No? Okay, he's trying to cut me off, the son of a bitch. Through here. Right. I mean, maybe I should be hiding in a locker at this point. Here he... Oh, never mind. I was going to say here he comes, but no. He's got other things on his mind. And I'm glad. I'm very glad. Up here. To the left. In here. Right, I didn't actually get to really have a look here, did I? What's this? Somewhere to hide? At the very least, there's somewhere to hide. Every time I hear that, I think, oh, he's just opening the door, but no, no. Oh, hang on. Bolt cutters? Oh, well, cutters? Yep, yeah, okay, well, there's the chain on the door, right? That's up here. Same thing. I just said that, and I just... Fucking freak myself out because of it. Okay, a, a headless corpse. 
Let's see. What you got inside you? Oh, another one. Okay, that's seven. Anything here? Nothing on the x-ray this time. Nothing on the bookshelf. <laughs> it really could have been that door. It really could have been. Right, so this is completely fucked, right? Even if I get the power on, it's just not going to work. So this one, that one just doesn't open. Uh, nothing there. Nope. Okay. He's below me, I'm fairly certain. Yeah, okay. Let's see if we can cut this. Yep. Okay. What is that? Oh, it's a key! I found a key! Right. A key that seems to point to the eye. Interesting. All right. Well, it, does it say what kind of key? It doesn't, does it? I wonder if I can get into the security room with that. Oh, there you go. Something in here? Oh, two statues in the same spot. Nice. Quite a few eyes I'm picking up. Okay. I can hear him. <laughs> I can hear him. Yeah, this is quite fun. Not the scariest thing in the world. I think he would probably be a bit scarier if I put it on hard mode, but that's my fault, and I just fucking wasted my stamina again. Bloody hell. Right. No, no, no. I, I actually need the specific security room key. Right. Oh god, he's coming. He's coming. He's coming! It's rattling, yeah, and it should be, because he is on the way. And that is a terrible place to hide. Okay, he seems to be, like, floating. He's a spirit, but he, he does have to abide by the rules, you know? He has to go around things. Okay. Uh, maybe in there I'm going to find uh, the other key. I'm kind of hoping so. Maybe I'm going to find another coin, too. Just, you know, while he's not here. I just want to make sure I didn't miss anything. Because you never know. I think he's on the way, isn't he? He's going up the stairs. Don't go... No. Shit. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, down, 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 down. Right, right, right. I'm going to go into that new room if I can. In here, yeah. Okay, what are we gonna find? We are going to find toilets! And a coin! And a statue! Oh, I really thought I was gonna find the last coin down the toilet. Oh, but the shower, that'll do, that'll do. Okay, I found 10 of those. And I've also found a key. He sounds close. And this is a bit of a dead end, this room. I don't like this. Let's get out of here, shall we? I need to get to the security room. Okay. Nice. Welcome. Thank you. And what's this? A fuse detail. Oh, for the box? Yeah, okay. Okay. Uh, I don't know why I'm looking around now. I don't know if we need to find anything more. I found the ten coins. <laughs> Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. He was real, real close there. He almost nabbed me, I think. Right. Quickly. Yep. I am going to see if I can run directly to the elevator. Okay, here. Does it work? Yes, it does, it does, it does. Close, close, right. You escape! You escape. That's it. I suppose it's only a beta. It's only the first chapter. Maybe there's going to be more monsters you have to outwit in other sections of the hospital or in completely different areas. I don't really know. But uh, there you go. That was quite fun. It was simple. It was 
kind of scary. He was fairly easy to maneuver around. I think if you're going to try this game, try it on hard mode. Really challenge yourself. Uh, but yeah, I quite like the concept and uh, it wasn't bad for like 20 minutes. See you next time. <laughs> there you go. There's a Lovecraftian influence right there. Well, thanks for that. Yeah, I think it is. And based on that rather ominous music, I wish I never picked that up. Can I put that back down again? <laughs> Draws. Wait. Do that again. <laughs> That's a door, not a draw. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, was that? Oh, God, that's me! <laughs> oh, yes, we got another one of these. Another little statuette. Another... Ah! Oh, jeez, okay. I can do that. Oh, there we go. I was, try <laughs> I was trying to run through the wall. Oh, look, there's another one. Am I sure that this is the power room? <laughs> it looks like another morgue to me. Let's see where he's going. Oh! <laughs> okay, let's go up here. No, okay, he's trying to cut me off, the son of a bitch. Here he... Oh, never mind. I was going to say here he comes, but no. He's got other things on his mind. Nothing on the bookshelf. <laughs> it really could have been that door. He's on the way, isn't he? He's going up the stairs. Don't go... No. Shit. 